and welcome to my channel. I am so glad that you guys came over today to see another brand new video. Today I'm going to show you a Pamper Chef haul. This is about, I want to say about $180 worth of items. I had two friends that had Pamper Chef parties in one week. So I wanted to support both my friends and I ordered enough to get free items and I reordered some items that I just love. So I wanted to share with you some of my favorites. I know we all get these notifications and sometimes it's like I have no idea what to buy. I don't know what's really gonna be good quality versus like what I can go to Walmart and buy cheaply. And so I just wanted to share with you some of the stuff that I'm actually rebuying and loving. So these are some of my favorites that I've had for years that I'm actually just replacing some of them and then I got a couple of cool new things. So let me show you guys really quick. The new things that I got is I got one, um, I think this is a four quart uh, bowl and I thought this was really cute because of the lid and everything like that. I have one of these that's bigger from Princess House um, back like 10 years ago and it's still going strong. I love that they have the lids on the top. I love anything with a lid. That's why I love um, Temptations Bakeware, of course, too. So I wanted um, one of these, so I got actually a small one. And I got this huge one. It is eight cups, so two liters. Same thing, comes with the lid, everything, and the handle. I love the handles because you can just like put them in and take them out of your refrigerator really easily. So this is something new that I have not got from Pamper Chef before, but I had got something similar over the years and really, really liked. A lot of times they give you free stuff, and I actually got this scraper for free. Um, I want to say it was like a 17 dollar value but it is really thick y'all like really thick kind of spatula scraper and I was like this is really cool I actually got two of them because I did two separate orders because I said I had two friends that were having parties I was like that's really nice it was either that or the mix and chop I'm sure everybody has the mix and chop from pamper chef because that's like a staple item I'll show you mine it is like this tool where you can like get in and like mix meat with it and this was the other thing you, you could get for free I don't use mine that often um only if the meat is like really frozen and then it's like wonderful to have so um I'm more of like a wooden spoon kind of girl and I, I break my meat up a lot of times with a wooden spoon so this was something I already had so that's why I got the spatulas I actually have my pamper chef wooden spoons and cutting boards that I've had for like oh my gosh maybe seven years I want to say if not a little bit more than that and so I really needed them to be replaced I used them like crazy so what I did was I got an order of wooden spoons like this on one order and then I got an order of another wooden spoons on another order so these hold up so well I mean for the price point so well I can't remember exactly how much they were but Gosh, they were like, they're a staple in my kitchen. They wash really good. They do really, really well. So I got one in one order, one in the other. It works out really good. It's really good for me. And I always like to have double of these kind of things because I don't know why. It seems like it just bugs me if I'm reaching for it and I don't have it. So sometimes I get a little bit behind, like all the time. And yeah, I just like to have double. So this is something that I got that I legit did not know if I was going to like or not like, but I have been buying um, straws a lot for iced coffee drinks that I make in the morning, and I was running out, and I thought, you know what, let me buy some reusable ones. So I got this pack of two reusable metal straws, and I really like the metal straws because it's like... The coffee's cold and everything like that. They do come with like a cleaner. And I thought that was really neat. I was like, oh, that's really cool. And it comes in like a little pouch. I actually thought this would be like a really cute gift if you knew somebody um, that would use it for some kind of purposes like that or somebody who drinks smoothies a lot or anything like that. For me, it was more of an iced coffee thing and a smoothie thing. I've been out of the smoothie game, but I really want to get a new blender and get back into it because my blender is driving me crazy. It has like a leak in it. I digress. <laughs> the other cool thing that I got that I'm just trying out is I actually got these, I actually got the measuring cup type or measuring spoons. And this one, basically what you do is you just slide your thumb up 
and put it on whatever the measurement is. So that says like two teaspoons and then I know that this is two teaspoons. If I need a whole tablespoon, I slide it down, whole tablespoon. I thought this would be really good because I tend to use where like I'm getting a spoonful of something and then I have to like wash it out, get another spoonful of something else. Um, and I really didn't like that, so I really wanted to have some extras on hand. And I thought that if I was using dry ingredients especially, that this would be one less thing to wash. So I actually got it in the smaller one too. This They come together, it's like a pack of um, two. And so this is like the teaspoon type of deal on here. So, um, so these two were perfect and they were really good price point, really. Um, I don't sell Pembroke Chef, just so you guys know. But um, I just thought they were really good. Like who could, can you ever have enough like teaspoons and measuring spoons? I just don't believe you can. <laughs> Especially if you like leave them all together. I feel like I need a couple different ones because oh my goodness, like I just feel like, you know, something gets in the half cup and then you have to put a half cup of something else and you have to stop, wash it out, do all that kind of stuff and then put your half cup in. It's better to just have multiples and as long as you can store them obviously and I thought things like this it's okay to have a multiple because you're not storing a whole bunch. I went ahead and got this scraper I actually have not used it and so it's basically to like scrape up and like I guess pick up whatever's on your cutting board and I thought it'd be a really good thing. I'm not 100% sure if I'm gonna love this or not um, it looks like it has a hard side and a soft side. I really don't even know how to use it. I need to look up a video. But, um, it was a really good price point. It would be a really good, like, stocking stuffer gift. And I just wanted one for so long. And I thought, you know what? I want to support my two friends. And what else can I add into my cart? So I mentioned to you guys that I had a couple staple items that I just love from Pampered Jeff that I've had for years and years and years. I love their plastic cutting mats. Love them. I actually got three of them, I want to say about eight years ago, and then about six or seven years ago, I had another friend at a party, I got three more, and I've been using six of the really big ones for ever now, and they, they're still going strong, but they do get like the cut marks on them, but um, they hold up so well in the dishwasher, it is worth it, and I love the way that they like grip to the counter it's really really good so this time I actually decided to get three of the small ones I've never done the small ones before I've always just had the big ones so I really wanted to try the small ones because a lot of my friends um, like the small ones and these are an amazing price point they're really cheap I have no idea. I couldn't even tell you how much but they're really cheap and I was like you know I'm gonna try the small ones too so I got three of the small ones so I'm the kind of girl that when I reach for something, I just want it to be clean. I just want it to be good. I just want it to be there. And so I got six of the bigger mats too. Look how big these are. So it actually has some like information on it too, which I guess would be really good. And it'd be really good to have as like a gift you were going to give to somebody, even like a wedding shower, um, something like that. Somebody who doesn't cook a lot. So you can give some information as long as with a really good item. So these hold up like, these hold up crazy good. So I actually got two sets. I got three and three, so I got six of them. And this was my last thing I got. Um, it was kind of a splurge item. It is actually the popcorn maker. So this is like a silicone kind of material, you'll see. And I guess what you do, I haven't used it yet, but you put your popcorn in the bottom there. You can put butter on the top here. I think you put a little bit of oil in here and then you put the lid on put the lid on and then you put it in the microwave for however long I kept the instructions I can't even remember and then it pops all your popcorn all in this um, this is actually the family size the family size it says is 20 cups okay I know that sounds crazy this is like the size of a regular bowl okay like me and my husband could eat this whole thing like it's not huge the regular size one, I want to say this was 35. The regular size one says it makes, I want to say eight cups or something like that. My girlfriend actually, who was having the party, told me that she got the regular size one and wished that she had got the big family size one because just for like her and her two girls, she had to pop it twice 
Um, she said it wasn't a big deal or anything, but any time saver in life is always good. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. And I'm really excited about this actually. My husband loves popcorn and so this should be really, really fun. And it'll de it's definitely an upfront investment, but it's gonna save us later on in the long run because we probably buy popcorn every two weeks, I bet. The microwave popcorn is what I'm talking about. So I think this will be really good. So that was all of my Pampered Chef haul. I just wanted to share that with you guys. I thought it would be really fun. Sometimes I know people have parties and you want to support your friend and you want to get something, but you're like, what am I going to get that's really going to be useful, that I'm really going to like? And so I thought I would share with you some of my favorites that I'm even rebuying years later because I like them so much. And then maybe that will help you in the long run with something you need or some gifts with the holidays coming up. Like how easy is it that somebody's having a pamper Chef party and you can get a couple easy gifts, some stocking stuffers. I just think that kind of stuff is good and it's really nice quality. So um, definitely to support a friend, I would love to pay a little bit bigger on the price point, support somebody and get a higher quality item. So I wanted to share that all with you. I hope that helps you next time that you get one of those notifications saying that one of your girlfriends is having a pamper Jeff party. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and I will see you in my next brand new video.